hello everyone welcome back to my channel in this video we are going to install laravel breeze using livewire into a new laravel project so to briefly cover what livewire is livewire is a powerful way of building dynamic reactive and front-end uis using just php so we can have an equivalent of an application for example if we are using Vue or react but we are going to do all this with php so that's livewire so to create a new laravel project we shall come to laravel.com this is the landing page of the documentation so we shall scroll down and find our commands to create to create a new laravel project so copy this coming to the terminal my terminal is already open and i'll paste that i'll call this project uh, i'll call it live wire underscore breeze since about live wire and laravel breeze so I'll click enter and let it install so that should take a few seconds and it's done so let me open up the project from vs code uh, file open desktop plan cool and this is our project so i'll open up the terminal and then run it around php artisan sub so if you run this in a browser we should have this page so that is the default page that appears when you install when you create a new Laravel application so how do we then install Laravel breeze we come on the documentation on the left side we come to packages and then under packages we have breeze as the first so as as here as they say laravel breeze is a minimal simple implementation of all of laravel's authentication features so these are authentication features bundled into one simple package that you can just install and everything is configured for you i've, I've copied this command to install laravel breeze so paste this in my terminal ah okay but uh before that let me just get in it and the reason i want is i want us to be able to see all all new files that will be installed after running this command so to do that i will just use git git add this is not very important but i think it's just a nice to have later on in the video you will kind of see why so so it means any new changes that we make to this product will be highlighted by git and we can be able to inspect them better so i'll copy this command paste it here let that run it should take a few seconds so the package itself uh, has been installed So if I'm to open up my GitHub desktop, if I bring it into view, you can see that now so far we have two changes in the package.json and log sorry, composer.json and uh, composer.log. So as you can see, Laravel Breeze version 1.24. So uh, so after that, I will just come below. Now these are options. You can use Breeze with Blade, which is basically the normal no more blade templates and then you have breeze with live wire have a breeze with reactor view i think i'll make a video on this as well if you want to see it you can let me know there's so breeze with, breeze with uh, next js api the also laravel jet stream that is kind of it has way more features compared to laravel breeze so we shall just come to what we want which is laravel breeze and live wire I will copy this first install. As you can see, there we have some options that come up: Blade with Alpine, Livewire with Alpine, React with Inertia, View with Inertia API only. So API only if you if your Laravel application is just going to be useful building APIs. So in this case, I'll choose the second option, which is Livewire with Alpine. Click Enter. Would you like dark mode? Nope. 
uh, which framework testing framework I'll go with paste and yeah it will do its thing it will start installing as you can see we already have changes here that have been that have been detected by git Uh, just a few more seconds but in the meantime let, let me open up github desktop if i do so you, should, you, should, you shall now be able to see all these changes that have been made by installing uh, laravel breeze using the live wire option so as you can see we have some email verify controller this is a controller for sending verification when you're verifying emails route service provider in case you're not very familiar what these do uh, don't worry you can always look at them and in subsequent videos so we have some components and so on and so forth so how do we then see this in action to do that i'll come to my to my dot env file and i'll create uh, uh, i'll pass the database name as livewire underscore breeze so i will come and quit migration so that uh, our table is created php artisan migrate yes uh, create it as you can see migrations have uh they are, they are, we have some migration so after that if i refresh you can see we, no, we now have these options of login and register this will only appear after we have set up breeze so if i come to login should it displays the login page if i come to register register page i can go back to login in case i forgot password so this is the advantage of using breeze that these are these features that almost every application needs are already built for you so you don't need to do a lot of uh, rebuilding repeating yourself this package just eases all that so i'll come i'll go i'll go back to register let me just use john i can spell you right john do john do at example.com password i'll use one two three four five six seven eight confirm password one two three four five six seven eight so i'll register as you can see we are now in the dashboard we have these options of profile and logout for but let me just log out i'm back to the home page if i go to login beyond at example.com repeat the password one two three four five six seven eight i'll be logged in so if i come to profile i'll have the profile i can edit uh, my name name that i've passed here let me just add and edit it and if i save we have a saved uh showing us it's saved even the name here is that marker reflected i can update my password i can delete my account so this is just a brief overview of of uh of breeze laravel breeze so that's how we install it uh in the subsequent video we may we may build a an application a blog application can we may create a blog and we shall be able to look into details about how, how we can use live wire and all its features but we shall uh, be relying on this laravel breeze for, for setting up authentication and managing basically the, the, the user profile all right that's it guys that this was a brief video of uh, introducing laravel live wire it was released a couple of hours ago so and yeah happy hacking cheers